Hey guys, so, uh, okay, one second. <laughs> We'll just let that go off in the background. Alright, so, today. Hi, this is Brenda from the Corning Lock-In. Yeah, we're just... Calling for Cheryl. Um, we have an appointment tomorrow. Um, just wanted to see if you could be here about an hour earlier. Um, the cars are lining up. It is in car testing. If you have any questions... <laughs> Okay, we are on a custom card Yu-Gi-Oh! Reddit, and today we're going to review some of them, because, yeah, why not? Uh, going to tell you guys this right now, I'm going to be uploading custom card reviews for a while, uh, so, anyways, we have El Shadal Awakening, Shadal Tier 1, please. Alright, so... Send one Shadal Flip Monster from your hand to the graveyard, and if you do, this effect becomes that monster's effect when it is flipped face up. If you control a Shadal Fusion Monster, you can send one Shadal Flip Monster from your deck. Instead, during the turn you activate this card, you cannot special summon monsters except Shadal Monsters. You can only activate one Shadal. Okay. So, this is alright. Uh, I don't really see any problems with this other than... Maybe make it a continuance? Not sure about a, a, being it. Well, maybe a quick play makes more sense. Actually, no, a quick play makes more sense. Never mind me. Uh, this is actually pretty good. I'd give this not a ranking. kick. <sighs> okay. Very cheer. All right, I cannot read that. Yilgamesh, King of Heroes. The King of Heroes goes bored of you. All right, this card is treated as a hero card. This card's effect cannot be negated. This card cannot be destroyed by card effects. You can special summon this card from your hand by discarding two cards or one hero monster from your hand. Assuming this is like for heroes, this is stupid. <laughs> it's a joke card, but why not? It's good as friendly. Okay, so you put on a lot of tacky like things onto it. Honestly though, this is a joke card, so <laughs> not gonna. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> So I think, uh, what, I think, um, because this, I think some of the, uh, custom card communities actually, like, give out, like, packs and whatnot, and, like, like, when I'm structured it, it's weird. Uh, but let's see here. Phantom Troop IX Hakimoto. Okay. If you have three or more phantom troop monsters in your graveyard you can special summon this card from your hand he only uses effect of phantom troop ix pakamoda once per turn once per turn you can target one spell or trap your opponent or one set card your opponent controls look at it your opponent cannot activate spells or traps in response to this effects activation this card is banished you you can look at the top five cards of your deck, then you can reveal one random trip monster among them and add it to your hand. Also, plus the remaining cards top of your deck. Okay. First effect, um, considering how fast you can get these phantom troop cards in the graveyard, I would say it's okay. Uh, and then the whole knowing what your card has set kind of reminds me of uh, spirals, which I think maybe this is going for. And then the last attack, if it is banished, is it's all right. Yeah, it's, it's it's good. All right, and this is a link monster, link two, two phantom troop monsters, phantom troop X I condemned witness. Um, phantom troop monsters. This card points to cannot be destroyed by battle. You can tribute this card. Add one phantom troop ritual monster from your deck to your hand. You can only use this effect. Okay, so you can just tribute the card. Add stuff to your hand. 
Cool. Light. In this dark and dangerous world, somebody has to help us. It's to make the job other heroes. Life keeper were born. New light cyber slicker control can have the new mechanic. Art no mind. Uh, I can't read this one because we've all got a lot of text. It's one I can read. I want to read one of these cards, please. Okay. Uh, he was patient here of Neots. Three cards. <laughs> one monster, one spell. Okay. Let's see if I can read this. This is interesting. Yes, there we go. This card's name can also be treated as Elemental Hero Neos at all times. This card can be special summoned from the hand of your opponent. Add more cards in the field than you. When this card is summoned, add one card which has Neos, Neos face, Neos face in your hero, in its test, favorite deck to your hand. There is a field spell active on the field. You can special summon one Neos face in your hero monster except Neos face in hero Neos from the deck. When this card will the field. For the extra deck or someone over here, I want to have this card back to your hand. So, this card is level 7, so you need two tributes for it. And, hmm. so, the summon effect is fine, it's absolutely fine, but, uh, I just don't think you're gonna have a field spell on field because no one uses Neo Space. Hello, please leave a message after the tone. <sighs> okay, back to this. This, the field of spell effect is not never going to be relevant because nobody plays Neo Space in any kind of strategy or deck that is revolving around Neo Spatians. And then I guess the last effect is fine. It's not groundbreaking or anything. The special summon effect. Is fine, I guess. There's nothing wrong with it. It's just would have preferred something different. Neo Space, the Neo Universe. Right, let's see what this is. This card's name is treated as Neo Space. Okay. All cards that list elemental here are Neos. That's fusion material. Don't have to return to the extra deck, okay? They also can gain 500 attack and can be destroyed by or targeted by card effects along with elemental hero Neos and any card with Neos Spatian in its name. If a fusion monster will, that lists elemental hero Neos as material to feel special summon one elemental hero Neos monster from the deck and the graveyard. Okay, so uh, I think that's fine. This is fine, it treats itself as Neos Space. Uh, you gain 500 attack, uh, your Neos fusions can't be destroyed or targeted by card effects, that's pretty good protection. Um, and the last effect is not really good, but it's still an option. Neo Spectral! Alright, this is a trap, it's normal. Target one elemental hero Neos or fusion monster that lists elemental hero Neos as fusion material. Special summon as many hero and new fusion monsters you can from the extra deck with different differing attributes. Differing is not proper PSCT, you want different in there, but I guess it's fine. 
from themselves or the targeted monster, but you can only special summon fusion monsters for the rest of this turn. If this card is in the graveyard, you can special summon a fusion monster that lists elemental hero Mias as a material. Set this card from the graveyard, but banish this card when it leaves the field. So, special summon as many. Okay, so you get Neos, you, ha you activate this, and then you special summon Hero or Neos Facial Monsters with different attributes from Neos. And I think Neos is a light monster, so there's options, yeah. If he's not a light, I can't remember what he is, but I'm pretty sure he's a light. Uh, uh, this is alright. It's not good. It's not bad either. So yeah, uh, I'm just gonna end this one here. So uh, I'm just gonna be uploading these for the past couple of weeks and whatnot. So uh, yeah, all right. I'll see you guys uh, next time.